Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Aaron XC, and welcome back to Final Fantasy VII. So we left off at this gold saucer, which I'm assuming I have to buy a ticket to, which is ridiculous. But, you know, whatever. You're welcome. If you leave, they go invalid. Any place where you must play with GP, just think of GP as money that you can only use at the gold saucer. GP can only be redeemed at the games in Wonder Square and at the Chocobo races. Your GP limit is 10,000, so please be careful. Please enjoy yourselves. I will try. For 3,000 gil, I better enjoy myself. Okay, so considering this is, like, cutscene-y, I'm going to assume I was supposed to do that. I'd be really angry if I wasn't, because that was half my frickin' gil. Wow, let's have fun! Fun? Who has fun in the Final Fantasy world? There's no time for fun. I know this isn't the right time to do this. Hey, Barrett, cheer up! I ain't in a cheery mood, so just leave me alone. Really? That's too bad. Let's go! Wasn't that a little harsh, Aerith? Just act normal when this happens. You think so? Of course. When what happens? What are you talking about? We're gonna go play! So play! Mess around all you want. Don't forget we're after Sephiroth. I think he's mad. If he's so mad and so against playing, why did he just go into one of the places where we're playing things? I'm not sure. He'll be fine. He seems to be doing a little better now. Am I doing okay? I don't know. Hi, Tifa. We better be careful. Sephiroth might be around. Oh, do I have to pick a friend? Well, I'm gonna talk to Elden first. I wish we could just forget everything and have fun! Well, I would too, except we're kind of in the middle of some shit, so... Sorry. You wanna go with me? No. I was just seeing if you had anything fun to say and you didn't. With me? No. I wonder if this- actually, what I bet is I bet it influences if there's any battles. And so if there are, I would very much like to have someone to heal me, so I'm going to go with Aerith, because Aerith is fun. Let's go! Can I go with multiple people? I'm gonna assume not. Yeah, I didn't think so. No, I don't want to go with Yuffie. Yeah, well, I'm gonna try to, Aerith. Let's go. Um, okay. Let's go to Chocobo Squares. Oh, there are guards right there. That's awkward. What happened? Shh! Shinra soldiers, even here. Attention! Dismissed! Okay. Am I supposed to follow them? I hope not, because I wasn't paying attention to where they went. I guess we go here? I don't know how this works. Oh gosh. Hey, boy. Boy. How is it? You having fun? Ooh, mm, so you are having fun. Well, good. Good for you, boy. My name's Cloud, and stop calling me Boy. Hmm? Me? I'm the owner of the Gold Saucer. The name's Dio. Just call me Dio. He's not even listening. By the way, Boy, do you know what a Black Materia is? No, actually, I don't. Tell me, please. <laughs> that, I say, that's a good one, Boy. But it's not good to lie. You can't fool me. I... but... I I don't know. I, I actually don't know. I don't know what you want from me. Why do you ask me? Well, a while back, a boy your age came in and asked me if I had black materia. I thought you might know who he was, seeing as how you're both about the same age. Did he happen to have a black cape? Why, yes. Yes, indeed. And a tattoo on his hand that said one. Where did he go? <laughs> I have no idea. Well then, you are unhelpful, sir. I say, stop by the battle arena if you like, boy. You'll probably like it. Many of my collections are on display there. Ha <laughs> You were not helpful. I did not like talking to you. But whatever, these are stairs. Get, get off the stairs. Oh, there we go. No, no, no. Talk to this dude. First, I gotta memorize the order it comes out, and then guess on the attacks. Okay. Um, I 
By the way, I'm sorry if I'm like moving awkwardly like in the range of the camera. This chair is rocky and like rocky like it rocks, not rocky like it's full of rocks. Um, and if I have a rocky chair then I like just unconsciously kind of rock in it and stuff. So if I'm moving all around the camera and it looks really strange, that's why. There you go. What do you have to say, sir? We have to be careful of these steps. What? A lot of things. Right. I'm assuming that goes back to the place we came in, and I don't want to do that because then there goes 3,000 guild on the dream. This is a very long hallway. What's this way? Is this a roller coaster? I like roller coasters. Hello. Would you like to see the Wall of Fame? Why not? Oh. You'll receive a plat prize if you get more than 3,000 points, so good luck. 3,000 points on what, though? Oh gosh. Oh gosh, I didn't want to do that. Whoa, there's different people here. I want to talk to the Chocobo. Screw these people that are right here in... Well, my... Uh, excuse me. <laughs> Hi, Chocobo. Welcome to the Gold Saucer. Oh, you're just the one that I talked to outside. What do you have to say? Um... Hey, I finally got 5,000 points. Wow, you're so wonderful. Oh, that's the girl. Man, I finally got a prize. Good for you. I didn't actually want to be out here, though. What? Uh, um. Go here, please. Thank you. That was weird. Here are the rules for this attraction? Sure. This attraction is the shooting coaster. While your ride's going zoom, you're going bang bang, and things are going pew pew, and you destroy them with a big boom. Pretty simple, isn't it? Oh, to shoot, hit OK. The bar on the left side of the screen is your power meter. When it's full, it'll go broom, and when it's empty, it'll only go broom and putter out. So be careful. If you make it to the top three, you'll get on the wall of fame. OK. What do you have to say? Um, I don't know where I get that. I haven't figured that out. Maybe I have to, like, I don't know. Maybe there's like an ATM or something. Um, so I can't- oh gosh. I don't know what's going on. What do you have to say? I'm sorry, we're currently renovating. Please come again. I don't even know what you're renovating, I don't even know where I am. So, whatever. What do you have to say? I don't- no, I won't, because I don't have any of this shit that you keep telling me to have. I don't understand. Whoa! Okay. I don't... I don't know what's going on. Okay. This is an arena. What do you have to say? Sorry, but there's no show now. I don't... What? I don't know where I'm going. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know... That is very fat and strange, but I want to talk to this person first. We put on a really unusual show here, but not today, so come back again sometime and see it. Well, I probably will never be coming back here, so... No, thanks. C can I not talk to you people? Do you not speak words? Jeez, what a jerk. Why don't you just leave us alone? I am sorry that I wanted to have a friendly conversation with you. What the fuck is that? <laughs> um, oh good, there's two of them. I mean, the things on top kind of look like moogles, but if they're like ghosts, because they like round and ghosty, but they look like they have moogle faces. But I don't know what those big fat puppy marshmallows are. Can I- can you not walk straight up? Get, 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 no, cloud, Jesus, God, t no, just, I just, I just want to talk. What's your problem? Can't you see we want to be alone? You were not worth all of that struggle. Why is he going down every single thing? I... The way that my controller is set up, I think it's the driver that I'm using, because I don't have a gamepad yet. I'm just using a PlayStation controller plugged into my computer. And the way that it's set up right now is I can't use the D-pad. I have to use the analog stick. Which, for a game like this, I really don't like that much. It's really quite annoying. And I would be great. <laughs> hey you! What are you looking so down for? Oh, it's another one of those fat marshmallowy things. How about it? Want me to read your fortune? A bright future. A happy future. Oh, but don't hold it against me if it doesn't come true. Then what kind of fortune teller are you? 
Oh, so sorry. I'm a fortune telling machine. The name's. Oh! Oh, it's Kate Sith! Okay. I don't know that name because I know the character, I know that name because it's in a lot of other, like, fantasy things. But cool, Kate Sith. You can only read the future? Are you kidding? I can find missing things, missing people, anything. Then can you tell me where a man named Sephiroth is? Sephiroth, right? Okay, here goes! Um. Ordinary luck. It will be an act of fortune. Give in to the goodwill of others and something big will happen after summer. Wait, hold on. Huh? Let me try again. Be careful of forgetfulness. Your lucky color is blue? Forget it. Wait, wait, give me another chance. Wait, let me try again! I kind of hope this isn't a recurring character. <laughs> but I mean, it has a name, so it was great. What the? What? What you pursue will be yours, but you will lose something dear. I don't know if it's good or bad. This is the first time I ever got something like this. Then shall we? What are you talking about? Being a fortune teller, this is gonna bug me. Oh, great. If I don't see how it turns out, I'll never be able to relax, so I'm going with you. What are we going to do, Cloud? I'm coming with you no matter what you say. Hey! Oh, great. That's, you know, that's just fantastic. So, I... They probably told you at the entrance, but most of the attractions at Gold Saucer only take GP. They don't sell GP. You can only get them from the Wonder Square games or at the Chocobo races. Thanks for telling me that, because I actually didn't know. And so I got the really big, huge spoiler at the end of this game, which I'm not going to say. But I got that spoiled for me because this is an old game and I, like, live on the internet. Um, so I definitely know what that fortune means. So that's good. It's great. It's a good time. Um, these people don't want to talk to me. Fine. I don't want to talk to you either. Um, what's up these stairs? Wah! Oh, okay. Oh, that says new. I don't- I don't know what I thought it said, but it did not look like new. Hi. I know I have zero GP. I have none. Unless you have something that is free. I cannot. What is over here? Are these more games? What do you have to say? One game- Oh, this is money. Is attacked to those points. No. Nope, I'm not quitting until I clear this. I actually just, yeah. Yeah, bam, bam, bam! Oh man, I gotta scream. Please don't. Whew, I'm tired. Oh, this? It seems to be out of order. God damn it. Don't worry about me. Go ahead and play. I wasn't worrying about you, I just wanted to see if you had something to say. I get so caught up in these. Um, what does this person have to say? Oh, well, I guess I could go over him. Back there. Good to know. So that's a thing. I'm not talking to you. Log house. You're not even gonna give me a description? Okay, then I don't want to play your stupid game. Oh, gosh. Um, okay. I guess that is out of order. That's a portion. No. I guess I'll try this. Which one's switch? I think it's select. Online. Or not. I'll just screw around with it. Nope, it's not. Oh, I figured it out. It's L1. Online. Whoops. Wrong direction. Oh god. Oh jeez, I'm so bad at this. Why did I choose this? Oh. Well, I'm doing okay, I guess. Oh gosh. It's- because it has to be so like, you have to be right next to them. Like, you can't be- Oh gosh, you can't be like, slightly in front of them. You have to be perfectly next to them. Which is just kind of annoying with the camera, the way the camera works in this part. It's kind of hard to tell. Um... Yeah. 
Go. No, 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 no. No. Nope. 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 I killed you. Get out. Ugh. Oh gosh. Come on. There we go. Nope. Hit him. There. Also, Cloud swings his sword really slowly, which I mean I get, considering it's like the gigantic- giganticest? That's not a word. The, like, biggest fucking sword I've probably ever seen. And he's using it one-handed, which is really impressive, by the way. I can't hit any of these stupid people. Um, but at the same time, it takes him forever to attack anything. Freaking hit them, please, Cloud. You are losing points. Stop. Thank you. So is Cloud, like... Is this, like, what Cloud is seeing on the screen? Is this some special form of, like, VR? Have they perfected VR in this world? Like... I don't know. Ooh. Can I just, like, run into that? I don't... That's weird. Oh. Well... I did kind of real shitty, I'm sure. 5,800 sounds like a big number, but first of all, there's a place for another zero. There's a place for another tens. But, yeah, I don't think that was too great. Well, I'm kind of curious. Well, actually, first question is how much deal do I have? Oh, I've still got a piece of mail. Well, I'm curious about what this is. So why don't we try it? This is Mog's house. It's in Mog Forest on Mount Mog. The beginning of another day in the life of a Mog. This, this year, Mog is a... is Pippapapuo... oh, Pippapapuo years old. That's 28 in human years. He's at that age when he should be looking for a mate. This, I feel like, is an aww. It's not gonna end well. But before Mog can become an adult, he first needs to learn how to fly. This Mog is a lot better than most of the- er, Moogle is a lot better than most of the ones that I've seen. Even though Mog trains hard every day, he still can't seem to get off the ground. I wonder if that's a limitation of the graphics, or they purposely made it fat. I don't know. Maybe it's- maybe he can't fly because he's fat and the story is about him not being fat anymore. I don't know, let's find out. Looks like he's still got a long way to go. Here's where you come in. Help Mog learn to fly it by pushing OK and feeding him his favorite Koopo nut. But don't overfeed him. He won't be able to fly if he's too fat. He's already too fat, I'm pretty sure. Get the nut. Get the nut. Get the nut. Yes? Can you fly? Here, have another nut. I don't know why I'm giving him any nuts in the first place. Like... Are they helping him? Because they seem like they're just going to make him fat and it's going to be harder to fly. I don't know. And yes, I am fully aware of all of the dirty jokes that I can make about the fact that I'm feeding him my notes, but I'm not going to because I'm better than that. Ooh. Feeding is nuts. It's hilarious. Can you do it? I believe in you. Oh? It seems like Mog has decided to take another shot at it. <gasps> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, I didn't read that. I'm sorry. I'm pushing start. Oh, that's. I'm sorry. I was not pushing start. That's pushing my new button. I. It was something about him having. He failed and then he's gonna have to wait for a bride. Um. That. Oh. <laughs> that was both really adorable and really sad at the same time. <laughs> I like that drum roll that we heard also. It sounds exactly like the one in Chocobo Racing, which I would not be surprised if it's exactly the same one because they're made by the same people. And I think they came out around the same time. Um, actually, no, it wouldn't have, because Chocobo Racing has Squall in it, who's from 8. 8? 9? 8? 
I think he's been eight. Um, so it would have had to come out at least after, or actually, well, it would have come out after Final Fantasy VIII, but it could have come, like, right after. They could have worked at the same time, on them at the same time. But I don't know. Come on, Mog, I believe in you. You can do it. Oh, no. Oh, this is really fun. I hope I'm not using Gil every single time that I, I am. I'm gonna do it one more time because I'm pretty sure I'm just using Gil every single time. I'm just gonna feed him as many times as I can um, throughout this whole time. Which, I don't know if it'll actually change anything. I don't even know if he can fly. It might just be one of those stupid scammy games where you just feed it all your money and then it gives you nothing in return. And then you wasted your entire, like, year's allowance on a game about a stupid mob trying to fly and find a bride in the span of, like, a day. And then you're sad, and you have no money left. Anyway. <laughs> Come on, Mog. Maybe I'm overfeeding him. Maybe that's what's happening. Okay, I'm actually... I have an idea. So, after this, I am gonna do it one more time, because I have an idea. Um... About how to make it work. Maybe I'm wrong, but hey, I'm actually curious, and so I'm gonna waste my money somewhere. He's gonna fail. Watch. And... <laughs> the graphics for this part are good enough so it doesn't super look like he's falling down the hill or like rolling down the hill or anything. It just looks like he's falling face first on something that doesn't like... I don't even know. It's not super realistic, which I mean I'm not gonna shit on the game for it. It was a limitation of the time that it was made. Um. So, I mean, whatever, it's whatever, and I've never been huge on critiquing graphics anyway, because I'm sure all of this shit is hard to make. Like, I don't even know where I would start. I actually thought about it when I was younger, I thought about being a physical in my room. I thought about, um, being a video game designer. My idea, by the way, is that he's all happy now, so I think I fed him the right amount, and if I feed him more, then he's gonna fall over and die. So I'm just gonna leave him and see if he can give it another shot and fly. Um, but I thought about being a game designer when I was younger, because I love video games so much, but, um, I, cause, and I mean, there's a lot of parts to game design, it's not just everyone designs the game, but at least, like, the animation side of it, I just don't have the patience to do animation of any kind, really. So, like, I thought about that, too, like, just animating in general. Is this gonna work? Was I right? I was right! Hey! He did it! He's flying! Now he's finally become a full-fledged mog. Yay! I'm smart. It only took me, like, four tries, but, you know, I did it. Okay, bye, mog. Is he not gonna get a bride? Is he just going back into his house? Hey, I learned how to fly. Thank you. Goodbye. Tired but relaxed, our little mog turns out the lights early and goes to bed. Good night and sweet dreams. Oh, is that a little me? Yes, it is. Oh, what's this? Here comes a female mog. Mm-hmm. Okay, so I'm going with the graphics were intentional that they are all supposed to be that bad. She's just gonna knock on the door randomly. Oh, it's pink. Look at that. Because we have to make sure that everybody understands that it's not a pink, that's not a male mog. That it's a pink mog, because, so therefore it's female. I'm not gonna get into that right now. Never mind. It seems like he likes her. <laughs> she is phasing through that mushroom. Her foot is through the mushroom. Now, will Mog be able to fly gracefully in front of her? Help him out with a few cupo cupo nuts. Oh, well, at least I understand how this works now, so I won't screw it up. I don't know, like, it said don't overfeed him, and then I was like, okay, but then I just fed him all of the ones that I could give him, and it didn't occur to me that maybe that was overfeeding him. Um, I think my reason for that is because there's so f there were so few nuts given. I gave him so few Koopo nuts, that's better, not much, um, that it didn't seem like I could, that could possibly be overfeeding him, but whatever. Oh, it seems like- oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go, I believe in you. Impress the lady. Yay! He's flying! Mog was able to do it! 
I wonder what would have happened if he had, if I had screwed it up and he had fallen on his face. Like, if they would have programmed something in for the female one to be like, lol, or something. I don't know. I don't think I'll ever know because I don't want to waste any more money on this game. She must have fallen for his graceful flying form. Oh, are they in love? Sometime later. They had sex. <laughs> Maybe not. Looks like things are going well with his new Mog friend. Time for a quiet date in the forest. Her name is Mag. Wow, that's real original. She's a good-natured Mog. I thought they were Moogles, and his name was Mog. Or have I been lied to? Best of luck to the both of you, Mog and Mag. May you have lots and lots of healthy Mogs. Oh, they did have snacks. There's a yellow one. I like it. Oh, there's a pink one. So if the pink ones are female, or... Oh. First of all, that was a shit ton of Mogs. Second of all, that poor Mog just fell over. Third of all, if the pink ones are female and the yellow ones are male, what are the yellow- or the white ones are male, what are the yellow ones? Uh, no worries there, I guess. Is that it? Bye! Bye! Do I get stuff for that? I helped him make a beautiful house. I don't get anything. Well... <sighs> well... Great. But anyway, I'm gonna leave that episode there. So, thank you. You. You right there. So much for watching. If you like what you see, be sure to show the channel some love, and I will see you in the next video. Well, unfortunately he didn't die. It's unfortunately he'll die eventually. Yes. Ha! That's your own fault. I was gonna be doing that much, which was a poor decision on my part. But hey, I hit pin again.